Another very common form of hyperparathyroidism does not typically require surgery and is normally treated just with medical management. This type of hyperparathyroidism most commonly occurs due to vitamin D deficiency or impaired kidney function, both of which cause otherwise normal parathyroid glands to overproduce PTH. In these cases, the parathyroid glands are normal. They're simply compensating for another problem, and that's why this condition is known as secondary hyperparathyroidism. Unlike primary hyperparathyroidism, which is discussed in another tutorial, calcium levels in secondary hyperparathyroidism are typically on the low side or just plain normal. And the diagnosis should be relatively easy to make. The treatment usually just involves addressing the underlying cause, either replacing vitamin D if it's deficient or treating underlying kidney disease. Treatment of secondary hyperparathyroidism is completely different from the treatment of primary hyperparathyroidism and surgery should never really be necessary. For ThyroidParathyroid.com, I'm Dr. Stephen Hodak.